The topology show as this picture. Make sure that Volta 1 has internet connection. Step 1, set up the Volta 1. Power on the Volta 1 and connect one of the Volta's LAN ports to computer by a cable. Open the browser on your computer. Type 192.168.0.1 in the address bar and then press enter. The default login password is admin. Type in admin and then click OK. Click on advanced. Make sure that Volta 1 has internet connection. Click Wireless. Change the primary SSID as you want. Choose the channel as channel 11. Click OK. Click Wireless Security. Disable WPS settings. Choose the security mode as WPA-PSK. Change the security key as you want. Click OK. Step 2. Set up the router 2. Power on the Volta 2 and connect one of the Volta's LAN ports to computer by a cable. Open the browser on your computer. Type in 192.168.0.1 in the address bar and then press enter. The default login password is admin. Type in admin and then click OK. Click on Advanced. Click LAN Settings. Change the IP address to 192.168.0.10. Click OK. Click OK. The router will reboot automatically. Please wait a minute. Log in the setting page again. Click on Advanced. Click Wireless and then click Wireless Extender. Choose WDS Bridge. Click Open Scan. Choose the SSID of your uplink router. Click OK. Select the security mode as WPA-PSK. Select the WPA algorithms as AES. Input the security key of voter 1. Click OK. You can see the SSID and channel of Volta 2 will change automatically. The security key of Volta 2 will 
also change automatically. Click Advanced and then click DHCP Server. Disable DHCP Server and then click OK. Step 3. Go back to set up the Rotor 1. Connect the PC to the Rotor 1's LAN port. Open the browser on your computer. Type 192.168.0.1 in the address bar and then press Enter. The debugging password is Admin. Click on Advanced. Click Wireless. Click Wireless Extender. Choose WDS Bridge. Click Open Scan. Choose the SSID of Rotor 2. Click OK. Select the security mode as WPA-PSK. Input the security key of Rotor 2. Click OK. Step 4. Verify the WDS bridge connectivity. Connect the PC to the Rotor 2's LAN port. Enter CMD and then click OK.